I'm Connor Hamilton with MGH Equipment, AntonioCarreroUS.com. In the garage today, I've got an Antonio Carrero SR7600 Infinity. I'm here to tell you about the joystick. This unit has the top of the line hydraulic package, and that includes the proportional electrohydraulic joystick. And so it is proportional in that the more you move the joystick, the more response you get from your hydraulics. This has a double safety, meaning there's an off on switch on the joystick itself, as well as this red operator presence switch has to be depressed with another button and then move the joystick for any of your controls. So that gives you some peace of mind that you can't accidentally bump the joystick and do something. But best practice when going down the road is still to have the joystick off, the three point locked out with the rate of drop. And then when you get back ready to work, flip the joystick on, open up the hydraulics and you're good to go. <clears throat> so this comes with three factory presets, one, two, and three outlined in the user manual. They all have the same functions available, but different functions are mapped differently to different buttons. And so it is a personal preference thing for how you want to operate the joystick. Tractors come with uh, the decals here that you can put on the armrest. And that's just a quick guide outlining what the controls do while you're learning and memorizing. It's nice to have something right there to look at. Um, it's also all outlined in the, the user manual on what does what. So everything in this tractor um, from the rear and front three points to all the hydraulic remotes and the PTO can be run from this joystick. So if you want to raise and lower the three point, then you've got your operator presence switch. This particular configuration, you're also holding the green button and then pull back to raise the three point, push forward to lower the three point. This is also equipped with a um, hydraulic cylinder for the right hand tie rod in order to uh, tilt the three point. And so you also now can tilt by going right and left with the joystick. You also have the ability to control the flow on all of your double acting remotes. And so typically you've got one button controlling two remotes. So with your present switch, for instance here, hold the red button forward and back. I'm controlling the set of double acting remotes with red caps. Same thing, hold the red button and go right or left. Now I'm controlling the flow out of the remotes with the brown caps just below. And so that's one way to efficiently operate remotes without pressing so many buttons. You basically got two functions uh, with each button. What you can also do with this is control your yellow single acting coupler with this white button, and that turns on continuous flow. So if you're running a hydraulic motor, you've got a dial here in the front of the tractor or the rear, I guess, but in front of you with the operator station reversed. And so you can dial in your rate of flow, you know, one, two, three, four, five gallons per minute, whatever your implement wants. And the continuous flow on this tractor takes priority. So when you have this engaged, then it is gonna fulfill the demand of what you have set for that single acting continuous flow coupler. All your other hydraulic functions are gonna be subordinate to that. You also have a hydraulic flow that is not priority. It's the uh, end of the line and it runs a yellow single acting coupler, but it's only going to provide that continuous flow when there's excess after the demand of all the other couplers has been met. A nice feature. You can also uh, activate and deactivate the PTO with the yellow button here and the universal uh, PTO emblem on it. And let's turn the uh, tractor on and I'll show you how you take the reverser control from this lever by the steering wheel and send it to the joystick. I'll let it run its self check. Okay, so it's easy. You've got a J button here. If you hold that down, you see your green lights, and now your reverser is here on the joystick. 
So say you're in this uh, rear-facing configuration because you want to be operating a forklift. Now you have a really user-friendly, ergonomic solution. You've got your hydraulic remotes for your top, tilt, lift, side shift, anything you can want are available right here on the joystick. And you're also going forward and back. And it's just a really nice, easy to use platform for running a forklift. When you're uh, heading down the road and you want the reverser off of the joystick back to the main controls, you just hold down the joystick button again, light goes out, and now if you move this switch, nothing happens. So that is a brief overview of all the incredible capabilities of this top-of-the-line um, proportional electrohydraulic joystick on the Antonio Carrero SR7600 Infinity. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.